Hey guys, welcome back to another Battle Chasers Night War. And so let's continue on our journey to the eastern part of the world. I believe um, we're going to continue to this. Actually, can we go through here? And uh, I, I know there's some guys in here, but I kind of want to skip them because I want to go directly to the eye. Because I want to I wanna see what our next um, adventure beholds, right? So, let's go up to the Siege Coast. Whoa, that sounds dangerous and fun. Oh, okay, let's get rid of this. Let's... You find an artillery encampment and hear intermittent sounds of cannon burst. Enter. Enter and kill the people there. Because they are our enemies. Because they've been shooting us from the from that side. And now. Siege Coast Cannon. So let's let's go. Okay. Ooh! Oh, that scared the heck out of me. Oh wow. Sounds like we're Oh. I I I, I was not ready for her to talk, so I didn't know what she said actually. But that thing scared me. It shook my, shook my heart. Oh, hey, you're not supposed to be here. Hit, hit up. Not our chance. Now's our chance. This isn't going to end well. Yeah, it isn't going to end well for you. For you. So, I think this is going to be real easy for you. Oh no. Oh, he's for he's Lee? What a coward. Yeah. That was anticlimactic. A coward. But he was smart to flee. His behavior is consistent with many bandits. Regardless, the road to town is clear now. We can head back and rest or push on to junk town. So we reached it. We finished. Assault junk town. But first, whoa, whoa. What's going on with the graphics? What? You know what, at least I can walk around and see. Ooh, Coast Rider Shawl, huh? And I got a necklace. Chain of Giant Might. So, let's see here. What did I... What did I get? A necklace with giant tooth attached, granting great strength. Yeah, let's switch that. Physical defense, magic defense, bonus damage. So I switch this with this. Nah, just keep it like that. Oh, it's fixed. You can see a wanted poster of Red Monica. The poster warns she is deadly, sneaky, and enchanting. At the bottom, someone, perhaps a fan of hers, has drawn an extremely flattering character of her. Oh, okay. Who is this Red Monica? I'm guessing she's red. And she's a girl. But why red? Why would you name yourself red? Unless it's something about fire... Or anger. Or she really likes to color red. Alright, let's let's leave. Let's leave and we need to go to junk town. Am I right? Because we need to assault junk town. But where is junk town? I wonder where it is. Oh. It's further up. What is that? It looks like a... Oh, it's red! Regulator. 
All right. So, let's kill the guy, the bandit scout first. Um, I'm pretty sure he'll be dead. There we go. Onion 12 hit points. And then have you attack me. In the face! Or in this case, in the circular dome. Okay, that was easier than I thought. Wave complete. What does that mean? There's another wave? Huh. Alright. Critical hit. And you should be done. And I think this should end your life. That's it, right? Yeah. Good. Ooh, we're almost at the next level. Level 14. I'm so excited because I'm happy to see what's next. Okay. So... Let's go to the eye. And see where that's taking us. What is this? Oh. We're supposed to go up, actually, but you know what? Let's just get that chest. Kill that regulator. It looks pretty awesome, though. It's red in that color. Pretty nice color. It looks pretty cool. And dead. Oh, by the way, I slept, so that's why my guys are fully healed and their mana are fully. Uh, they're full. Medallion. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, let's go back. Let's wait. This medallion. This medallion was worn during shamanistic rituals by the wandering mystic Alia. Alia. It was due to. Contact spirits from otherworldly planes. Bonus damage. Nah. Hmm. Let's just leave it like that first. And let's continue on our journey. Upward and beyond. Oh, actually, I'm gonna go up here. Actually, a lot of uh, a lot of treasure chests here. You know what? Let's let's get some of the. Oh, okay, okay. This is this is gonna be fun. Ow. We're kind of slow. No! Is he gonna bleed? We're pretty slow here. Okay, let's. And you overkill bonus earned. And one more should do it, guys. Yep, that's it. There's only one, uh, one round, right? There's not another six second one, because that would suck. And that's it. 21. Yeah, I want to get all these items here. So I can build some more stuff. Let's get that. And let's drink from the Fountain of Youth. You, your combat prowess increased. What does that mean? Does that, does that mean I'm stronger? Yeah, I think so. Wild caller. What does that even mean? I, I don't understand. I, I, I don't get it. I don't get it. What is wild caller? Does that mean you call on animals to come and help you? Are you a shot caller? Is that, is that what it means? Well, you're dead now. You can't call anybody. You can't phone home and call. And that should be it. 
Wow, they're pretty good with this uh, proudness. Increased attack ability. So that was pretty good. Oh, we got a second round. All right. Oh, this is, this is going to hurt. In the gut. And in the circuits. That's it. Good. I'm starting to think as we progress, it's going to get harder and harder, which means it's going to be more than just one or two or even three. Okay, let's... What's this? Huh. Strange. Place for a tavern. Calling it a tavern is generous. This place looks like a dive. Still, dives typically have information. Might be worth checking out. Just stay behind, Bredo and I. That won't be a problem. What's a dive? It reminds me of a pool. That's what I'm just thinking. A dive. Point break cantina. Okay. It's pretty cool. Can I loot? Oh, I can. Uh, I can't go this way. Okay. Can I fish? You know what? I can. <gasps> and I just bought some really good... No, I want to change. I want to equip this. There we go. There we go. Now. Uh, let's fish. I want to see how good this is, this lure. Oh, it is good. So we got some good ones. Okay. Let's go with one more. I want to see, and then I'll get all the fish. And then we're going to call it. I'm, guess, I'm guessing this is a turtle. Oh, it's a frog. Ocean frog. The ocean frog has the ability to jump tremendous distance underwater. Some naysayers claim they just... Swimming. Okay, you know what? These are really new. These are new ones. So, maybe I'll catch something different. No, 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 no. Okay, these are just the same. So, you know what, guys? I'm going to catch all this. And uh, when I finish, I'm going to come back. Okay, so that should be the last. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> I'm not going to catch him. Oh, he got away. Dang it. I thought I was going to be skilled at this. Okay, let's... Let's get him. Come on, come on, come on. I know you... Uh, my lure is pretty strong. So you pretty sure I can get him. Okay, there we go. Ooh, cautious sea slug. Apparently he was not cautious enough because, well, he got him. So it's a shellfish known for its dis distasteful flavor. Yeah, it does not look very appetizing. So we're done. Let's get out of here. And now, let's see what we can, uh, can we trade? Needle Mouse. Is it possible for us to trade here? No? Who's there? Is someone there? What? Is that a talking barrel? Nolan? What? Nolan! Buddy! I can't believe you're safe, but you were stuffed in a barrel. Do we want to know? Nope, you don't. And what are the odds I blew up the barrel just as you're walking by? Convenient how these things work out. What happened to you? No time for details, tough guy. Story for a later date. Right now, we've got bandits moving goods for a shady lady. We know. They have an artifact. Maybe more than one. And you were right. There's mana on the island. Of course I was right! <laughs> Looks like we're officially involved, then. I'm glad you are unharmed. Uh, don't get all mushy on me, Rust Bucket. We've got work to do. The bandits wouldn't stop jabbering about Junk Town and an important delivery there. 
the artifact blade? Probably. You guys have been making noise on the island already, so they know you're around. <laughs> Turns out their boss lady is pretty ticked about it. Finally, some good news. That's the spirit. Now, how about a drink at the cantina before we get to fighting? No thanks. Ah, right. You're off the sauce. Well, junk town it is, then. Oh, my back is killing me. Head out immediately. Stay and explore. Okay. Uh, can we use Nolan? Oh, let's explore this area first. Looks pretty... Looks pretty cool. Very beautiful, actually. But let's go up here. And... Just some items. Okay. It looks like... Like a boat. Like a submarine. Someone has written, as I sit here drinking my beer, I cannot help but think of things I held dear. My watch, my weapon, my amulet, my ships, a good, a good conversation, a kiss on the lips. My love was a treasure I held above all. I've met no one kinder than I can recall. I planned to take her to a faraway land where nothing could hurt her, as was my plan. Why then you wonder why I look so forlorn? Both her and my ship sank in the bottom. In the storm. Well, that's that's pretty sad. What's in here? You know what? Let's go in here first. What is it? A note hang conspicuously on the wall. This is Arthur J. Stefanelli workshop. Yes, that's Arthur Stefanelli, the Technomancer. Anyone is welcome here. I don't care which faction or whatever you are. As long as you respect the machinery, you are welcome to enjoy what is here. Just don't break anything. Hooligans. Okay. Maybe we can use it. To upgrade our gear. But first, let's loot his area. This seer stone has been repurposed to play unique events you have already witnessed. Its crystal can reach far into your mind and retrieve memories and play them for you. The, what video would you like to watch? Let's go with the ancient artifact. What is that? Ah, I haven't seen it already. No, thank you. Okay. Wow. This engine could be powered with something. Use the power cell. After starting the engine, a loose sheet of paper falls out from under. Fisherman's treasure map. Whoa. Okay. Maybe we'll be it'll be something useful up ahead. Can I use this? I seriously want to use this. No? Where is the um... Where is it? No, it's not here and I can't- I don't think we can use it. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, so let's continue on and explore this area. Oh, I, I guess that was it. <laughs> let's go to the left and go to that one area where Hold on, let me go in here. What is this? No, that's nothing. Go to that one area that we skipped. I believe... It should be down here. Yeah, there we go. Let's go in. Oh, this looks kind of dark. Oh, there's a guy here. As you approach this surely man eyes you up and down. Eh? Who might you be? You certainly don't look like the type to come around here. You look troubled. Troubled. 
That's a kind of way of putting it. Some people don't like our way of living, but at least we have rules. There's one man in particular though, he's what troubles me. We'll get what's coming to him one day. Tell me more. His name's Everston, the Red. He has a streak in him, a vile streak. Worst fella I ever met. These days, I hear he's hiding out in junk town. If he went missing one day, that would make quite a few people happy. That's all I'll say about that. I'll look out for him. Find Everston, the Red, in junk town. Okay. That's another side quest, I guess. You come across two patrons embroiled in a bitter debate. One of them has his hand placed surreptitiously on his pistol under the table. Oh no. What seemed to be the problem here? The patron on the right says, This clown will believe anything a captain says. The one on the left replied, Even if they be lying, they got our best interests at heart. Wow, this conference is going nowhere. How about we go get a drink? Okay, back slowly away. So this is the old fashioned way. I'm starting to think we argue about this too much. The one on the right says maybe that's what they want anyway. Make sure we hate each other and not them. The picture on the left says, what we're doing, no one cares a half coin about us. They both smile weirdly. Their shoulder relax as they exhale deeply. Okay, good. We solved that problem. You know what? Let's let's go here. Anything up here? No. Oh, you can explore in this area. Wow, very detailed. Very impressed. I just hate that noise though, the little sound. Whoa, whoa, what? What did I get? Band of Guile. Nope. Evade stamina. No, that's not good enough. Alright, let's continue on. Can I just jump? You know what I wish? I wish we can move, but also this character allow us to climb or jump. It'll be a lot easier. Okay, we can't talk to him. We gotta go all the way around. Okay, we can't, we can't talk this way. Okay, I can't talk to him. Now let's talk to this guy then. The bartender doesn't seem very interested in new customers. Get lost, okay. <laughs> Try to order a drink. Clucker hot wings. Never mind. Okay, let's go on in here. What's in here? I guess uh, he's asleep. Hey there, stole your weapon and we'll have no quarrel. I'm not much of a fighter. I'm more of a gambler. Nope, no more gambling for me. You guys swindle me so much that I... I am not gonna play anymore with you guys. I learned my lesson. Ooh, what's this? Further up? Two tanks in disrepair lie dormant among piles of scrap and junk. Perhaps there's some way they could be repaired. OEM Energy. This book contains schematics for operating and repairing tanks. You find the entry that matches the description of the two tanks in the room, which spe specifies a few parts necessary to repair. You make a note of it. High power core. Constructor. OEM energy. Okay. We'll come back for you. And now, let's get out of here. 
What's this? Can we talk to him? No. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, so we got out of that area. And now we can actually... S we need to select... Thirteen at uh, thirteen XP. Huh. I don't know. I don't know. Well, let's choose her. At the party. It must contain exactly three heroes. Oh. I see. You know what? I'm going to remove you for a second, okay? I don't know. I want to see his... You know what? Just temporarily. I want to see what he has. Arcane light. Brightly illuminate the area while in the magic light. Stealth creatures will be revealed and the party will begin combat with a damaged shield. Place a trap in the dungeon. If an enemy passes over it, their movement will be slowed. Okay. Okay. And what do you have? Arcane defense. Ice blast. Deal 44 magic damage and chill the target. Lowering their haste by 10% for 3 turns. Generate 5 overcharge. Arcane Missile. Deal 58 magic damage and apply Arcane Sickness. Okay, you know what? We're gonna use him. Just for a little bit to see how he is. And then we'll, if you don't like it, we'll go back to Calibrito. So guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for some more content of Battle Chasers Night War. I'll see you guys next time.